Hello and good day, welcome to our YouTube channel, God's Promises. And today's video will be a fast, concise overview. Book of Isaiah, chapter 55. Let's get started now. Isaiah chapter 55 is a powerful chapter in the book of Isaiah that speaks about God's invitation to come to him and receive his grace and salvation. In this chapter, we see how God invites people to turn to him, to seek his face, and to find his salvation. The chapter begins with an invitation to come and receive God's free gift of salvation. The prophet Isaiah calls out to those who are thirsty to come and drink from the waters of life that God freely offers. He says, Ho, everyone who thirsts, come to the waters, and you that have no money, come, buy and eat. Isaiah 55 verse 1 This invitation to come and receive God's grace and salvation is open to all, regardless of their social status or financial means. God is not interested in our wealth or power but rather in our hearts. He invites us to come to Him just as we are, with our brokenness and our sin, and He promises to heal us, forgive us, and transform us. In the next verses, Isaiah reminds the people of the greatness of God and how his thoughts and ways are higher than ours. He says, For my thoughts are not your thoughts, nor are your ways my ways, says the Lord. For as the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways and my thoughts than your thoughts. Isaiah 55 verses 8 to 9. This reminds us that God's ways and thoughts are beyond our comprehension and we need to trust him and submit to his will. He sees the bigger picture and knows what is best for us. We must learn to let go of our own understanding and trust in his sovereignty. The chapter ends with a promise of hope and restoration. Isaiah tells the people that God's word will not return to him empty, but it will accomplish its purpose. He says, For you shall go out in joy and be led back in peace, the mountains and the hills before you shall burst into song and all the trees of the field shall clap their hands. Isaiah 55 verse 12 This is a beautiful image of the joy and celebration that will come when God's people turn to him and receive his grace and salvation. It reminds us that God's promises are true, and he is faithful to fulfill them. The teaching application of Isaiah chapter 55 is clear. God invites us to come to him and receive his free gift of salvation. We must turn away from our sin and seek him with all our hearts. We must trust in his ways and submit to his will, knowing that his thoughts are higher than ours. And we must cling to the promise of hope and restoration that comes when we turn to him and follow his ways. In our day-to-day -day lives, we can apply the teachings of Isaiah 55 by seeking God daily in prayer, reading his word, and submitting to his will. We can trust in his promises and cling to the hope that comes from knowing him. And we can share his love and grace with those around us, inviting them to come to him and find the same hope and joy that we have found in him. In conclusion, Isaiah chapter 55 is a powerful reminder of God's invitation to come to him and receive his grace and salvation. We must respond to his call by seeking him with all our hearts, trusting in his ways, and clinging to his promises. And we must share his love and grace with others, inviting them to join us on this journey of faith and hope. Thank you for visiting us today. Please share with us your favorite Bible chapter below in the comments section. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It really does help our channel grow. Looking forward to see you back here for our next video. Always take good care.